Hey gang, welcome back again to Ken Tamplin Vocal Academy where the proof is in the singing. I'm doing this by uh, request. Vocal Coach reacts to uh, different requests that come in and the one I got was male singers hitting female singers high notes. And since I like to sing high notes, I thought I'd uh, check it out. Sounds quite interesting. So let's, I haven't heard it yet, so let's just dive right in. That was killer, man. That guy was awesome. Who is that guy? That was great. He had, you need a bad guy to play And he goes in and out of uh, uh, his chest and head right up. Man, that was killer. All right, let's, man, this is gonna be fun. Here we go. Cool. He didn't have her. <laughs> how she kind of loses uh, her uh, her voice. It goes in and out there for a minute. But he, excellent job. Cool, man. Hey, this is fun. I'm enjoying this. These guys are great. Cool. Before we go on, I'm actually doing a version that's ironic. I, I'm, like I said, I haven't seen this video, but uh, with um, uh, um, Zio, Chris, uh, Ziamara Crystal, we just did this song, so we're going to be releasing this song. I don't know when these things are going to release or not, but hopefully I'll get it in time to put it in the description so you can see how we did on uh, Adagio with uh, Laura Fabian. So but let's check out the male version. Here we go. It's a great song. Great singer. He got caught a little bit on the vibrato at the end of that, but he's still killing it. Yeah, good job. Um, you know, a couple things too. Um, it's really tough for you know tenors to sing up in this upper register stuff because a lot of it sits right in the registration break. So like, if he's a he is a tenor, he's really he's a freak of nature. In fact, I want to call him D Smash because the guy smashes everything he takes on in a good way, right? Uh, D Smash uh, would be a good name nickname for him. Anyway, but um, is it sits right in the register break, so it, they've got to really build his, it, the the uh, mixed voice that we've talked about when we talked about the Luther Vandross video. And again, I don't know when I'm going to release these, but if it sits right at the at the at the bump at the speed bump at the register break, you've got to really force that throat to stay open or train it to stay open so that you don't hear the the speed bump or you know the eh, eh, the yodel as it goes through, and you have a crystal clear clean note right in that break. And he is a master at that. So good job, D Smash. Here we go. Now, 
the question is, I don't know how old this guy is, but if he's prepubescent, uh, it's a lot easier for him to hit those notes like early Michael Jackson than once his voice actually drops the octave and he's got to find a way to get back up there. And I cover that in my singing course, by the way. If you go, like, look at Ryan Hyrie and some other people, which I walk them through pubescence um, so that you maintain that range as a, as a younger singer and you don't lose that as you get into your, um, you know, post-pubescent years. And that's really important to understand how to do that for the, you real young singers out there. One thing that she did, she mine used to be mine. Her sound was pharyngeally spread, which is a fancy word for you know, your mouth to smile into the sound. And he's coming, you still be mine. So he's a lot more narrow on the sound. It's harder to sing uh, those notes with a more narrow sound like he did. So if you want to make that an easier sound, just smile a little bit and bring that sound onto the front of the face, and you'll be able to hit those notes a little easier. Okay? Thought I'd point that out along the way. Here we go. Wow. Whistle register. That's pretty cool. Uh, that looked like another, another vocal coach because this guy's doing a lot of advertising right now. So it's pretty funny to see that. I wonder if that was really him doing that. Probably was. Uh, but the Smash or Dimash can do that too. So he's an absolute monster at all that stuff too. Check out Dimash, man. The guy's a rock star when it comes to being able to morph himself into a lot of these different um, high note, high registration things. So let's continue. Just give this song too. We're going to put this out again. You know, I think it's really cool. A lot of the Asian communities are coming in and they're really appreciating a lot of older stuff that's harder to hit. And, you know, they're going after really epic, uh, legendary epic kind of songs like that, like Heart and whatnot, and some newer stuff too. But it's really cool to see the rest of the world appreciate stuff because we've kind of walked away from that a bit. Uh, and, you know, we concentrate a little bit more on glitz and glamour and, you know, being a star. And these guys are going after, in a lot of cases, um, sheer talent, which is really cool. Like he actually broke the tape, you could see the little split in there, and then he took a breath and then he went up into his head voice. But when he came back down, he didn't bring it down into his chest voice like a lot of the other guys are doing. So, yeah, it's, it's a cool head voice example, but not as good as some of the other guys that are on this reel. Good job though, but still not as cool as some of the other stuff. Here we go. real high note like she did, but that's cool.
in Tola. Bring me down. Right? He's 100% head voice. So it's cool, but again, it's cooler to hear the other guys that are in your chest. They go into the mix voice, they go into your head voice, back to mix, and come on back down. It's another thing just to stay in your head voice like that. Killer effort. Really great head, head voice, but not as cool again as some of the other stuff. And I love the pentatonics guy giving him some help out there on the, on the right side. Uh, whoever put this video together, hey, thank you for doing that, man. I love you guys just, you know, spending the time and grabbing some interesting stuff and put it together. Uh, I have a singing course. It is called How to Sing Better Than Anyone Else. And we walk through all of this stuff step by step, how to achieve these different sounds and goals and whatnot, and have a free singing forum. It's called, uh, it's at kentemplevocalacademy.com. And come by and say hi. There's about just under 10,000 singers in there right now, all talking about how to do this stuff. And uh, say hi to me on Facebook, Twitter, uh, Pinterest, where else am I at? Uh, Instagram. Just come by and say hello. And I hope you guys like what you heard. Please like and subscribe to my channel if you want to hear more stuff. And until next time, peace out. Hey guys, if you like what you heard, please like and subscribe to my channel by clicking on the subscribe button. That will actually take you to another page where you want to click on the bell icon and it opens up a menu and the menu has notifications on it where there's a little box you can check where it says send me all notifications for this channel. Check the box and then click the save button and you'll get notifications from me every time I have a cool video come out. Okay, thanks guys. Peace out.